Hello, you're welcome. How to solve this nice exponential equation solution from here? What we have here, we can write this as x squared over 36 times 6 times 6, which is also 6 squared, equals to here we can write this as 6 times 6 times 6 squared over x squared. Then here we cross multiply x squared times x squared. Then equals to also here we have six square times six square. Then next step here, when we have same thing multiplying a times a, that's same thing as a square. But this here we have x square or square. Then equals to here we have six square or square. Then from here we take the right hand side to the left hand side we have x square. All square minus c square all square then equals to zero here. This follows when we have a square minus b square, which is the same thing as a plus b into brackets, open brackets, a minus b. That is here a standing as x square and b standing as six square. Then what we have here becomes x square plus 6 square into brackets, then open brackets x square minus 6 square plus brackets equals to 0 here. That is, here we have two possible cases. First time we have x square plus 6 square equals to 0, or we have x square minus 6 square equals to 0 here. Then, solving from here, this follows when we have a square plus b square, which is the same thing as a plus b i into brackets, then also open bracket a minus b i. At this here, this becomes x plus 6i into brackets, then into brackets x minus 6i. Close bracket equals to zero here. At this here also we have two possible cases. First one x plus six i equals to zero, or we have x minus six i equals to zero. At this here we have x equals to minus six i, which is a which is a complex solution here. And also here we have x equals to six i. Which is also a complex solution here. Making two complex solutions from here. Then, so from the second case here, we have x square minus 6 square equals to 0. That is, this also follows when we have a square minus b square, which is the same thing as a plus b into bracket, then bracket a minus b. Then this also becomes x plus 6 into brackets, open bracket x minus 6 close bracket equals to 0 here. At this here we have two possible cases x plus 6 equals to 0 or we have x minus 6 equals to 0 here. At this here we have x equals to minus 6 which is a real solution here. Yeah. Also here we have x equals to 6, which is also a real solution. Yeah. Making two real solutions here. Yeah. Altogether we have four solutions, two real and two complex solutions. When we write it out here, yeah, all we have becomes x1, we have equals to 6 x2 equals to minus 6 x3 equals to 6i then x4 equals to minus 6i that's making two re and two complex solutions here then let's check if this satisfies this given problem we substitute the value of x here when x equals to 6, this equation becomes 6 square over 36. Is it equals to, also here we have 36 over 6 square. 
Then 6 square, that's 6 times 6, which is 36 over 36. Is it equals to, also here we have 36 over 6 square, that's 36. And of course, 36 over 36 is 1, which is equals to also 1. Left hand side is equals to the right hand side, that is x equals to 6. Satisfy this given problem. Then, when x equals to minus 6, also, this equation becomes minus 6 square over 36. Is it equals to also here we have 36 over minus 6 square? Then here, minus 6 square, that's minus 6 times minus 6, that's 36 over also 36. Is it equals to here we have also 36 over minus 6 square, that's also 36. And 36 over 1 here, that's 1, which is equals to also 36 over 1, that's 1. Left hand side equals to the right hand side. Then x equals to minus 6 to satisfy this given problem. Then also, we substitute x equals to 6i. Then this equation becomes 6i all square over 36. Is it equals to, also here we have 36 over 6i all square. Then the square here affects 6, that's 6 square, and times also i, that's i square, then over 36. Is it equals to here also we have 36 over 6 squared times i squared? And 6 squared, 6 times 6, that's 36, then times i squared minus 1 over 36. Is it equals to here as well we have 36 over 6 squared, 36 times i squared minus 1? And here, 36 comes to each other, we have minus 1. Is it equals to here also, 36 comes to each other, we have 1 over minus 1. Then here, this is minus 1, which is equals to 1 over minus 1 is also minus 1. Left hand side equals to the right hand side. And therefore, 6R also satisfies this given problem. Then we substitute x equals to minus 6I. That is, this equation becomes minus 6I all square over 36 is it equals to 36 over minus 6i all square then here minus square is plus and 6 square 36 i square minus 1 over 36 is it equals to also here we have 36 over 6 square minus square plus 6 square 36 times i square minus 1 then here, the 6 cancel each other, we have minus 1. Is it equals to also, the 6 cancel each other, 1 over minus 1. And this is 1, which is equals to, I mean, this minus 1, which is equals to 1 over minus 1, also minus 1. Then left hand side equals to the right hand side. And therefore, we conclude that minus 6i also satisfies this given problem. And thank you for watching. Don't forget these steps. Subscribe for more videos. And turn the description bell. Share this video. Give it a thumbs up. Put your comments. See you next class. And bye for now.